Hey everyone, Mango7 Roll here. How we doing today? Welcome to another episode of RTA. We're going to be RTAing basically one day for the rest of this. I'm going to be recording all of these in uh, a single day, so I think I've got five to record. I'll uh, space them out in the videos, and if you haven't seen the previous ones, this is episode two. Uh, go watch the others in the link description below if you enjoy these. Also, let me know the format you like from these. Uh, the thing with RTA is I try to show all the battles so I'm not just cherry picking, like, right? I, I want to give you the real experience of climbing and uh, the types of units people use and the types of battles. And sometimes that means you're going to tank first tank. And that is not too exciting. But I don't really want to just not put them in because it feels kind of like deceiving you know anyways let's jump into this uh we're starting out at 2616 let's see where we end up okay so episode one or battle one is going to showcase a new character i geared up uh which is not cerise it is cute you big jerk <laughs> that's a little frustrating uh it was going to be kisei we built her up just for this i figured i loved her so much back then oh, why not give her defense. just a little shot and see just see how it goes, right? Um, maybe I should have just stunned the uh, Sinful there, but she probably has a ton of ER. Uh, I landed both debuffs, so. <laughs> uh, he does have the Tagayels, which I'm not really worried about here. Like, I can't see anything killing me here. And I'm just going to cleanse whatever off with uh, Meg Chloe when it comes to it. I love how... Uh, not t -Sarin. I love how Carrot just, like, ignores that, too. It's like, really, Carrot? <laughs> feel like this is gonna do, like, 30% of my HP. Yeah. Um. So I feel like he's in, like, mega trouble, right? Uh, unfortunately, uh, Carrot went ahead of the, um the thing and so did Landy. Hmm, did I change you. my my gear a little bit? Either way, uh, they did all their debuffs. I have my my buffs back oh, and okay. I'm about to go ham. <laughs> Is basically it. I'm about to go super omega ham. Um and I am going to go straight for the I'm going to go straight for the uh, Alexis. Nice. I'm going to go straight for the uh, T-Surin because I think I can kill her with uh, Carrot and Landy next. And I want to make sure she dies because once she dies, I know I don't see a problem. And again, uh, another thing I want to say is uh, I'm a noob, right? Like, I don't RTA. I, I don't... I'm not the best at it. So if you see me misplaying or maybe a, a character I could have drafted better or something like that, let me know in the comments below. Uh, be nice about it. Don't be like, Mango, you suck. Um, I mean, you could do that. And I don't mind the comments because it always helps the YouTube algorithm. But um, at least let me show you the Kisei as well. Uh, but I'm just going to ignore it if, you, if you're if you super jerky about it. But if you're constructive, uh, maybe we'll we'll learn about it and showcase it in the next video. So this is the Kisei right now. Um, 284 speed, she's on Alexa's and the decreased duration here. Uh, 3400 attack, 50% crit rate, 250 crit damage. I have no idea how to build her. That's just kind of what I did. Today's victory <laughs> Easy win number two. Uh, we're doing 10 a day, so. For the future of Sidonia. Why does everybody keep banning my Kisei? <laughs> oh god, I realize I have no DPS. That's why. Um I will not just stand by and watch. Whoops, a daisy. I oh, I do have a DPS. There's Landy. Years, this guy's dead. No <laughs> Are you ready? I've not fought Archdemon Mercedes before. Maybe I should have stunned the Luluka as well. But I'm assuming she's going to try for a kill, and it's going to bring, like, make Chloe to 30% at, at the, mo the minimum. Probably at, like, 50%. Yeah, 50% exactly. Ooh! Ooh! 
Okay, so, so far I'm not really scared of her. She hasn't done anything yet. Um, we're also going to be proccing a invincibility for the Earth. Uh, what's it called? Skill Nullifier for the s which is nice. <laughs> and we might as well stun now. Yeah, I mean... I don't see how you get out of this one. Um, a lot of people are picking G Purgus for, against me and then just dying. Um, a lot. <laughs> Next battle, let's go. Okay, this was a really weird draft. I wasn't sure how to handle this. Um, I wasn't sure if I should ban the Ruel or one of the DPS, but I felt like with the speed on my side here, that maybe I can just kill them before stuff happens. This will be the last moon they see. But also this means the uh, the T Siren is gonna cause me a lot of problems. But I'm actually gonna be going here. I've never used her before. I don't know how much damage she's gonna do or what, right? Um, and this is okay because we can burn her back, which is always fantastic. And this also procs buffs before they get to go. I'll show you some results. So I, I feel like we're gonna we're gonna be fine here. Oh, this is a tough call. This is a tough call here. No, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. No, I shouldn't have done it. I shouldn't have done it. Cause now um there's a good chance my Kisei dies. I should not have done that. That was really dumb. I should have just single targeted and then um, got my skill two off with my Kisei. That was not smart. I just got super greedy. Because now this is going to kill the Kisei and I'm going to take the landing. Doesn't kill the Kisei. Okay, that's pretty solid. I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. So... Landy here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to burn this and hope we crit. Wow. We missed. I mean, we didn't miss. <laughs> we just didn't crit. So that's a little unfortunate. Um, we have 90% chance to crit. So that is really, really, really super unfortunate because this is going to hurt. But hopefully Carrot just like does carrot things, right? Because they're going to take a lot of burns. Like, look at all these burns. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, buddy. So I want to make sure um, she doesn't go too much after this. If we get a carrot, that should kill. Oh, this goes off first, eh? Which means it'll give her another burn. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So now she's got her skill three up. Oh, no, she didn't skill three last time, right? So let's, I'm going to go here. Does not submit to threats. Then I'm going to go here. Get me. Then I'm going to go here. Then I'm going to lap. No, didn't lap. Okay. Yeah. So I should be fine now. We got an Albus proc. We got... Relatively lucky, I would say, with our Albus procs. <laughs> GG. Okay, that was an interesting battle. Uh, Kisei did a decent job, I think. She shut down the SSB. She did a decent amount of damage. Um, and she would have done a lot better if I didn't miss that crit. So, yeah, 4-0. Let's keep going. So one thing you'll notice is I am consistently picking the same units at the start, just because that's what I'm comfortable with. Uh, this isn't more of an experimentation RTA thing, it's just to climb, you know? Um, so I've been kind of picking the same characters. Obviously these three are my most used, they're also my highest success rate. And then from there I kind of splash in a little fun. Um,
So I think we are going to ban... We're going to ban the Arby and hope he bans the Maid Chloe. Okay, it doesn't ban the Maid Chloe. That was a little little rough, but I think this is going to be still okay. Uh, I've got a lot of ways to combat this, and um, I think it'll be fine. An eternal night will so we did get greater attack. Let's kind of just see what kind of damage this does. I have no idea. I've never had greater attack before. <laughs> you disrespect me. Okay, 10k damage. Like, 10k damage is pretty good. So now, the problem is, I'm still going to get skill 2'd, right? I'm still going to get skill 2'd here, which sucks. Uh, so maybe I shouldn't have done this, because this isn't going to finish off the... Uh... Yeah, just barely doesn't finish it off. Um, but she won't get a turn or anything, because she's got a flame barrier now, and she'll be dead. Statistically. Uh, and luckily now, Meg Chloe isn't as bad as she was. Ooh, that was dumb. Ooh, we survived. Now she's dead. Meg Chloe isn't as bad as she was because uh, now she can dispel too, right? So we will do all these things. We got another greater attack. I mean, let's do some damage. Or not? <laughs> very appetizing, but oh well. Is that all so I'm gonna have to go for the haste next, I think. Don't waste my time. This is it. Hopefully this doesn't double kill. It will double kill. Doesn't double kill. Okay, I'm okay with them getting all their stuff. I'm okay with that. Um, so we are going to be going. He's on Idol's cheer though. He's on idols tier. Yeah, we're gonna have to go anyway. The shards of moonlight will fall. Um, and this does damage when they're buffed. So we're gonna just see how much damage this does. Okay, I mean that's, that's some damage. <laughs> that's also twice now we have just barely not killed somebody, which is a little unfortunate. Um, hopefully we get enough souls to get one extra bop here. And now we are in a pickle. Now we are in a pickle here. I think we just go like this. Just to get a little bit of extra healing and stuff, right? Uh... No, no extra healing. Um, so we're gonna go like that. I will protect my people. We're then going to stun this, way. this. Just kidding. We're gonna give her attack buff. That sucks. Okay, that was actually pretty good of them to do that, because now I feel like now I feel semi okay. So we're just going to do this again. Three turns. Yeah, I don't think we're going to survive three turns. But I'm going to try to stun. Because if we can get a stun, that's really, really helpful, obviously. And this might not kill Cerise. It doesn't kill Cerise. Okay. So we can just keep attacking. I will protect my people. Um, yeah, we could just keep attacking. <laughs> and we're two turns, right? So next turn, we will be getting a, uh... We'll be getting a burn into... I'll show you my power. Oh, we're gonna be... We're gonna be, like, one short, aren't we? Fight them. This is it. Yeah, we're just barely short. So I'm going to go here. So if we can get a stun there. I think we lap. No, we don't lap her. Okay, so I think we're dead now. No, no, we're alive. And she doesn't have her skill three, right? She doesn't have her skill three. So now we can revive. And she can kill one person, right? 
Gotta be the Kisei. Yeah, gotta be the Kisei, I figured. So now what we can do... Get a stun. Okay, that's... A little unfortunate. But she doesn't have her skill 3 up. So... The question is, I guess, do we proc Etikas? No we do not proc Etikas. Okay, so that's really bad news. We needed to proc Etikas there. Oh! Interesting choice there. That is a really interesting choice, because now if we get, like, a dual attack here... Oh, that was so close. GG. That was a really good battle. We were so close to taking out Zerato. So I've previously just not banned Zerato, um, but I think I probably should be banning Zerato, especially with the way I play, um, especially with Carrot and Cerise, although usually I can kind of work my way around them. So that was a lesson learned for sure. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe as always. It is super important for videos like this because I know a lot of you want to see RTA, but it's really hard to do them. And if uh, y'all don't hit like and comment on all those shenanigans, it's harder for me to make them because YouTube algorithms. So feel free to go down in the bottom there, hit that comment button, tell me how good slash bad I am, and I will talk to y'all later. Bye, everybody.